Hello and welcome to the world of Pisces. Pisces, I hope that you all are radiating positive energy at this time. Let's hop right into it, Pisces. Let's collect the energy of your person. Let's see what's their feelings for you here. And we have the two of torches. So this person wants some form of forward movement here, Pisces. They're planning to um, come towards you here. That's their energy towards you. They want to come in here. And it's like a decision needs to be made. It's like they trying to decide which road they going to take. It's like two doors right there. It's like, you know, this person trying to decide which how to come come at you, right? They trying to figure out how to come at you when they come towards you here, right? So they trying to decide on something here. Let's see. We also have the eight of torches which is the eight of wands. They want to kind of speed this process up. It's some form of communication. They want to come towards you to have a conversation about something. All right. What else is in this person's energy for Pisces? We have the two of pentacles. They definitely juggling some type of idea here and they don't know how to come at you with it yet. Right. They don't know if it's going to uh make you happy or is it gonna right like i don't know make you be still or pause right so it's like this person is juggling the idea around and they want to come in and communicate about it let's get one more what's in this person's energy and we have the four cups here right they feel like you bored with them they miss you here Right? They miss you here. They want to offer you their cup, but it's like they kind of shy because it's like, dang, I offer Pisces my cup once and I messed that up. Two and I messed that up. Three and I messed that up. Like, okay, this is my last chance. I, I can't even look you in the eye, but I still want to love you, right? I don't want to miss out on this. I don't want you to not mess with me no more, right? I don't want to, you know, not have you in my life. I'm missing you, right? Right, so this person juggling around an idea here, right? What is what is this idea this person is juggling around? And we have the strength card here. <laughs> Pisces, this person trying to, you know, he like sticking their hand in the mouth of the the lion, right? So it's like the strength card here. It's like maybe, you know, it's like I feel like they want to be a little bit aggressive. You know, I feel like they. It's like. This this feels like. Pisces, well, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be honest because I, I want to try to watch how I say it. But this just feels like this person wants rough sex. And they want to, they juggling this idea around. It's like, I'm trying to figure out which avenue I'm going to take with Pisces when I come in and, and talk to them about this situation here. Right? And I want to hurry up and talk about this because... I've been juggling this idea around for a long time, man. And I just want to know if you are into bondage and, um, you know, just rough sex or, you know, real freaky stuff, right? And I feel like that's what, that's where the strength is coming in at it. Because it's like I got to be brave, but, but, you know, soft, but you know, assertive, like, you know, but it's like, I'm just, I'm trying to figure out how to come in and ask Pisces, can we do some real freaky, nasty shit, right? That's just period, right? They juggling around this idea, Pisces, this person don't want to, they, they, it's like they, they messed up. They didn't had this already from you. Nasty, freaky sex, right? And they want it again, Right, they want it again. For you may have been holding back or holding out on them, but they want it again. And it's like I messed up so many times, Pisces. I know, man. Could give me one more chance, cause it's like they kind of thirsty for it, right? It's like they kind of thirsty for it, right? Maybe they lick your fingers or something, you know. 
But let's see what else come. What else? What other ideas are they juggling around? Right? The Prince of Pentacles. They want you to ride them like a bull. Right? Why swinging from the chandelier? <laughs> Hell, I don't know. But it's like, yes, outside maybe. Maybe outside in the backyard in a storm. Right? And this person wants this to be something quiet. Right? They, they don't, you know, we don't talk about this type of shit to nobody. Right? About our personal sex life. You know, the Page of Pentacles... Play the back. They don't nobody really know nothing about the page of pentacles, right? So this person, you know, don't want you to talk to nobody about whatever they coming in to ask you, you know, on do you want to be involved in this bondage? Okay, what a, what other ideas is this person juggling around, right? And it's the six of wands, the six of torches, right? So it's like they want to succeed at this, right? They they can see it happening. They play it out in their mind. It's like they finna like the way, right? They very confident that you're going to be on board with this. Like you go give it to her one last time or something, right? That's the energy, Pisces. This person juggling, tossing around an idea on how to come at you to see if y'all could do some real kinky stuff. Maybe something y'all ain't never done before. Like, let's just go there. Let's just do everything, right? Like, they want to do everything with you. They want to touch places you ain't even know you had, right? So, let's see. What is this? Um, let's go to this uh two of wands because see this is another idea they got right because remember it's two doors on here so right we it's like they want to come towards you when they come towards you like what 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 are they gonna say like what because what? <laughs> i want to know and it's like the tower it's like they go chicken out at first right it's like they go either chicken out or you gonna be like hell no nah, right so it's like Something ain't going to work out. The universe ain't about to let something work out. Maybe it's because it's a third party involved. Because you see those three hands? Like, maybe it was all good if it was just me and you. But when you add somebody else, it's like, hell no. Right? So maybe this person also was thinking about, you know, inviting somebody else into it too. Right? And we got the emperor. Oh, my fucking God. Look at the emperor, y'all. It's like shield and the lamb. That motherfucker got a lamb thing. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's a lamb. Wow. Right? That motherfucker got him lamb chop, right? But it looks like the devil. If you look at the face, it's like he got on the devil mask or something, right? And it's the emperor here. And it's like shield and the lamb, Right? Oh, man. I don't know if this person... Um, this Maybe this is the mask they want to dress up in. Maybe this is how they want to role play it or something. You know, with bondage and shit. They wear masks and leathers and chains and whips and shit. But this motherfucker got a shield and a lamb. They got that lamb thing. I'm telling you, man. Between their legs, they work her with something heavy. Right? And something strong, something that has to be shielded, right? Wear protection, wear protection, right? Right? Mm. It's just something here. This person want to take control over this situation. I'm feeling like, you know, if you don't agree with one thing they asking for, they go right into the next thing to ask. Right, they okay. You don't want to do that. You want to have a threesome, okay? You don't want to have a threesome. You know, you know, just keep asking you questions about it, right? It's like they want to kill the pee. They want to kill the cat, right? It's like they want they want it once and for all, right? That's what get them. That puts them on some type of high, right? It puts them on some type of high, Pisces, with this ten of swords. Right? It's like once and for all. Let's do it. Let's do it. This is the last time. Right? Then it could be over like some crazy shit. Mm. Wow. 
All right, so let's see what this person what 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 did what, what, what did they miss? I just want to know what happened, right? What why is this person coming back? And it's the three of wands. They want some form of forward movement, right? They've been waiting for a long time and they just want to move forward. It's like they going crazy. It's like they fucking go to the edge of the cliff every night, sit right there and think about how they going to move forward with you. How they going to keep you in their life, right? And it's like when they come in, they come in the shame, though. It's like they can't even look you in your eyes, though. It's like, why is this person looking down? Oh, my goodness. Because they truly in love with you here. This person really want to offer you their cup. It's like they might want something serious with you, Pisces. It was like if we could do all this, if you into all this, man, we could share something special. Look, it's like just dip me in your cup. It's like I'm drowning in your cup, right? And then when I try to come out your cup, I just fall into a bigger damn cup, right? So it's like this person just sit up and think about you all the time and what they want to do to you. I feel like this person is obsessed and they fantasize about you all the time. And they see visions of this going down literally in their head, how they role play it and, and, and what they do when it's over. It's like they be on a natural high and they be waiting to do it all over again in the morning. And, and it's like this person, you know, I think that this person fell in love with you, Pisces, for real. For real, I think that this person fell in love with you, and I think they they like uh freaky shit. They like freaky shit, and you like freaky shit, and you all probably did some real freaky shit. But this person want to go deeper, so it's like however deep y'all went, no matter what level, they want to go deeper. Right. And I feel like they want to go a little bit darker. They want to get a little bit rougher with you. They want to role play. They want to do some strange things here. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, what else comes with this for the empress here? This person values you. But is she holding a baby? It's like she breastfeeding the baby pisces you nurture this person's ego you you nurture their sexual desire right you 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 breeded this you know it's like it's like you're the mother of this you're you're the only person that can do this and get that intimate with them Right. They, they trust that you are the person to get that intimate. That'll be into all of this here when this empress showed up and her nursing that baby. Right. This person is in love with you. They're in love with your milk. They in love with your waters and they want to do all kind of freaky shit to you. Right. And, and they just that's the energy. They want to have some form of success. They want to role play. They want to invite people in and, and with everything, right? They want to be on a natural high and start all over tomorrow. With this eight of wands, they just want to know if you with it. If you with it, how deep can you go? How Look, it's like, how deep can you go? How far down can we swim? And this is the wands, right? So it's like, yeah, let's see what comes with this eight of wands here. And we have the hermit. But it's in the reverse. Right. And I'm trying to look at it to see what I can gather from it. It's a cat there. Right. It's a cat there. It's a companion. Right. This person is missing you as their companion. They feel like you, they other half, like you, they soulmate. And it's like they searching for that feeling that you give them. They searching for that feeling and they obsessing about it. And they thinking about all sorts of other things that y'all could be doing. Right. And this is what they looking for, Pisces. This is what they seeking out of you here. A good time, a sexual fulfillment. Right. That's what they looking for. They they like to move fast on that type of shit. Right. They want to try to talk you into doing some crazy sexual freaky shit. Right. So what else comes with this eight of wands? And it's the wheel of fortune. Hell, you might like it. Right? This the type of sex that change your life. Right? You feel good when 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 um this little lamb get on you, right? So it's just like shit. You with the shits, Pisces. You might be with the shits here. 
Look at the Queen of Cups. Dive in it. But your cup empty, right? Your cup empty. Your cup empty, Pisces. It's like you looking in it like, okay, where the love go, right? It went in you. It went in you, right? Y'all probably made a baby. Go make a baby. This person probably won't even get you pregnant. But it, it's like a good time though, right? All right, let's get one more for this Eight of Wands here. Oh, it's the High Priestess. This person in your head, they in your thoughts, right? Oh, man, this person is in your soul. Look at that little doorway. This person is in you. They didn't plant the seed in you, Pisces. They didn't plant the seed in you. Ooh-wee. Ooh-wee. Look, you could write a book about it. Look, look how innocent you supposed to be. Right? This person, man, you hold them close to you. They hold you close to them. However it go. Like this some deep shit. That's done happen, right? Ooh wee. Right? So this person really feeling you though. But they do. They want to have a good time with you. Maybe it ain't just a good time. Maybe they just like this. They want to have this good time with you. They do want to do that. But I think it's more because it's like when this high priestess came out, it's like this person know you like a book. It's like they know you like a book and it's like you live inside of them. Right? It's like you live inside of them. They always think about you. They're always manifesting you, Pisces. You could be their little freaky little secret. Right? You could be what's crossing this energy. The sun. It's like nothing makes them happier. Right? This is the good life. This is the good life right here. I get to have somebody that I could do all these things to. Right? I done fell in love. I done fell in love. I done fell in love. Like, this is uh, overflowing. Uh, uh, this is a lot of love, right? I, I, done, I, done, I done got your milk now, right? I done got your milk. It done, You done made it rain on me. Okay? There's no way. We could do a whole lot more, right? You everything. This is this is anything. This is you can't get no better than this. That's how they feel, Pisces. Woo wee! Somebody gonna be walking funny tomorrow. All right. So let's. Uh, that's the energy, y'all. I hope it resonated. Let's get a word from the chakra wisdom to promote positivity. To see what chakra needs to be worked on, or to simply get an inspirational quote that we could say to ourselves each and every day. Pisces, we have the fourth chakra, and this is the heart chakra, and this one is, is radiate warmth and sincerity, okay? I am open to sharing, accepting, communicating, and connecting with others as I focus on this moment, not the past or the future. Mm, okay, a smile, a kind-hearted way of speaking, or a hug goes a long way towards uplifting others. <laughs> I offer care and support where I can without rescuing. I nurture and respect my relationships. Mm. So warmth and sincerity here, y'all. All right. Oh, all right. If you're new to my channel and you like this video, go ahead, hit that like or subscribe button. For those of you who are returning, thank you for your continued support. And remember that your comments are always welcome. This is all I have, Pisces. As always, be safe, be blessed, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.